Okay guys, I got a review for you. Um, I'm loving this Combiner Wars thing going on with Transformers this year. And I did get Megatron. Uh, never been big on the tank uh, mode or the tank uh, incarnation of Megatron at all, but when I saw the figure, I'm like, man, he looks good. And I actually uh, started liking that tank quite a bit. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna get this guy. I always get two or three of everything and uh, actually opened one to play with. Uh, I did get a Masterpiece Prime, a couple of those from Toys R Us, and he's like the best toy ever. But um, this is just to show a comparison between the two, which I thought was gonna be pretty nice, and it actually is. You keep them a little distance, they look good. But on to the main point of this is they have all these add-on kits. Um, for these guys, for the combiners, I did get the one coming from Menasaur because it's supposed to help them. But other than that, I don't, you know, the price is uh, $40 for the add-on for Megatron uh, for the new kit that's coming out. And I actually just like the barrel um, part of that kit. So I don't want to pay $40 for something like that. Look at that light piping coming from the early morning sun. That looks pretty cool, actually. I wonder if I can turn them here. So anyway, so I decided to make a barrel, um, and it, it looks pretty good on them actually. So uh, just made it out of dowel rod, and uh, it connects there in the back into a hole. I don't know how the, the add-on kit's going to work and stuff. I did put a peg on the back there, and that's so when he's in tank mode, that can hook on to the to the tank itself. So it's just not. You know, hanging out there, so uh, not perfect. Could have done it smoother, but it does give the effect and looks great uh, from a distance, for sure. So um, to show you in tank mode here, if I can transform him uh, kind of quickly here, I do like the simplicity of um, the Combiner Wars. So it's not too bad getting these guys into their robot forms pretty quickly so just give me a minute here dun, 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 dun. I'll probably just do this kind of quick and haphazardly here but just to get the point across You can see he's been in battle, but anyway, kind of get the point there. But see, I made that peg there, so it just fits in there kind of stiff. Uh, pretty stiff, actually, so so it can turn and stuff. Might look silly, but it doesn't, um, doesn't leave it loose then anywhere if I want to transform him, which I actually do fairly like often because he looks pretty cool. Looks like a real cannon. It does. So my nephew's here. My kids are just waking up. I was hoping to get this video done soon. I might start doing a little more um, reviews on uh, these Combiner Wars because I'm liking them quite a bit. So uh, I do like that add-on there. That actually looks pretty good. So, um, And I want to do some other videos here on like the original uh, Superion and Menasaur next to the new Combiner Wars. Of course I got the Dinobots here too. Those are actually knockoffs. Uh, yeah, you can beat me up for that. But uh, they are awesome quality, no issues there um, at all, really. So, swoop even. Anyway, but yeah, I'd like to get the original. Uh, oh, there's a picture of me and the wife. Oops. Of course, they're not all that stable. But anyway, maybe more videos to come to compare these guys to the new ones which I thought would be cool uh, to do. So anyway, I will cut her for now.